And that is a wrap on Budapest. I'm so sad that we're leaving. That apartment was great. Bye apartment. Now we are headed to the train station to go to Vienna. Please excuse my accent. It is Vienna, not Vienna. Vienna. Starbucks across the street, so that's what we're gonna get for breakfast. Sorry, we're so lame. We tried to find somewhere else, but there was not a single open coffee shop or uh, cafe, whatever, cafe anything. Yeah. on this road. So, last resort. So sorry. Not really, because I love Starbucks. All right, let's get some coffee. has been acquired we've checked the board and our train has been delayed by 20 minutes already so now we're supposed to leave at 9 o'clock instead of 8 40 so we're just gonna eat breakfast and I seriously got the weirdest thing it was ham cheese and blueberry jam how do we feel about that for anyone wondering what I got I have not repeated yet I had a croissant with ham and cheese and tomato and arugula. And I'm already starving. Yeah, so we're gonna try to find something else in the station. We still have 20 minutes till our train leaves and hopefully no more delays. With our leftover money, I got some sort of vanilla puff pastry. We aren't sure what's in here, but they're little pastries filled with, it looks like blueberry, apricot, maybe chocolate. Chocolate, maybe. It all, all together, it was 450 florent, which is one dollar, basically. Yeah. Maybe a dollar fifty. which there's been a train on platform seven all morning. reserved and no one kicks us out of it. If not, we're gonna have a nice ride to Vienna. We have been kicked out of our second car and now we're just hanging out in the hallway. We're waiting for the train to take off again and we'll take another pass down this hall to see if there, is. there are two seats in the attack. We have about an hour left. Next time we are definitely booking seats because I didn't think it would be this hard to find seats. We are taking a train from Vienna to Salzburg and from Salzburg to Munich and I'm pretty sure we don't have reserved seats on those either.
get to our Airbnb and then explore the city. place for ourselves it's massive we'll show you in a second the cleaning lady is still here cleaning up from the previous tenant but this place is gonna be great we are gonna pack our bag our day pack right now and head out we're gonna grab we're gonna try to grab some lunch and go explore this is our bedroom kind of have like lofted ceiling We decided to take an Uber here because it would be a 30 minute walk and I was kind of tired from standing up the last part of our train. So I convinced Taylor to get an Uber. It was seven euros here and now we're gonna explore. One thing I did wanna note was that they never checked our passports on the train, which I thought was so weird. Maybe I put my passport information when I booked the ticket and so that was like their way of checking that I had a valid passport, but we for sure thought that at one point we stopped at the border and we thought for sure that that was going to be the point where they like come by and check your passports, but nope. Also, they left us these cute little chocolates on our pillows. So, I'm going to dig into it now because I'm starving. <laughs> Oh, why don't I go there? Hmm. Hmm. Don't know what it is. 